What is up guys, it is your boy Twitter here and this will be a video of the first look of Assassin and by far I've been playing this character till level 45 plus and it is amazing. It's really fast, a lot of nice flashy skills, few dashes which are obviously supposed to be there. So let me just show you what the gameplay is actually like. Hi baby, what are you doing? You fucking slut trying to wave at people all right got my buttons all up in check let's go so first off let me just show you some of the most amazing moves in this game so you got a few heavy moves which is on this one this is by far the best move in the game oh my god now you got another one which summons like a lot of shurikens looks nice as well kills everything in one go oh, fuck. picking up things that's what mr. wooferson is all for picking up shit all right so Another heavy move that we got, which is one of my favorites as well, is uh, this skill. Boop! And after that, you can just kick people into the dome, and if you do it really fast, you can make it all work. There we go, nice and ass grab. And there we go, just finish these bitches off. <laughs> Alright, so you got yourself a nice movement speed buff skill which allow you to run a lot faster. So I upgraded it to the maximum and I would say it's really fast. Whee! There's also a high skill which I rarely use but does a gazillion damage. See, there we go, things dead in one go. And there we go, kill everything into the building. The only downside to this character so far is its energy consumption. Like the bigger skill, this one takes up like 60 stamina. And you don't have all that much, so I am going to try having a full armor of whatever and see if that actually works there. Now there's also a skill to pop behind your enemies, which is awesome as well. And some other jams. So, in comparison to some other classes, this class has some nice ass CC. Oh yeah, this one, the heavy skills, I rarely use it, but it's still funny. Ouch. Okay, that freaking hurts. I got it only to the first level because I wasn't sure if I would level it. As well as one other ultimate skill. I don't have them all leveled yet because some of them seem slow as shit and I don't like slow skills. So there we go. Hide. Okay, that was the different skill. And sometimes you see me pop skills before one of the heavy moves. That's only for one reason. Uh, they will just automatically give you a higher percentage of speed and whatsoever. So it's... All part of the bigger plans. There we go. Running speed. Now, although this doesn't seem all that useful, it's still funny. Also, one of the bigger things is the double jump capacity. I haven't seen it being used all that much, and I haven't been using it myself. But there's ways to attack with this. Uh, I probably need some energy. So if I double jump into F, I can actually knock people down, which is good. Like, it could be used in PvP if you just backdash, jump in, and jump forward. Now, there's always mix-ups that you can do with the, with the dashes as well. So this is one of the dashes. This is also a dash. You can backward dash, and you can frontward dash. Now, you can use the same stuff up in the air, so you can just dash up dash to the side or even dash to the back if you really want to fake something out and then just hit somebody so there's all good ways to manipulate your positioning and that's one of the things that makes this character like a lot and I mean a lot of fun also the backward dash allows you to uh, get through characters it's similar to the uh, 
to the blader one blader has the same exact mechanic where you can use your dash to do that but I would say this class is less um, mobile than the blader one because the blader one you can actually spam it this one cannot be spammed because it has a cooldown of like a sheer one second In all fairness, I think this class would be a lot better if I had more stamina. Now, one of the things that I all also like a lot, I need to find a dog for this. Uh, and there we go, level up. Easy as shit. Like, the leveling on this character is ridiculous. I've been only playing this character for one day. Almost got it to max, or well, not max, level 50, it's different. I'm not sure how the PvP works with this class yet, but it seems that the height purposes are actually really good. Look at that, just lots and lots of damage. And so much CC capacity, which is used. The only downside is the high thingies don't work all that that well. But there's also ways to buff yourself. So you can use this, and you receive a few buffs. Let's see which one does. This is the height buff, and it doesn't work like that. Some other buffs which do either evasion or something else not quite certain but in all fairness the stuns and everything see that is one of the most amazing dazes within the game just a high skill and you can use it to front and backward pop yourself to get into somebody's face get the nice healing skill of regeneration And after the dashes, you can just plainly do attacks. And this is one of the things that I use as well. If you do uh, a front or a sideward dash or a backward dash, uh, you can use your left and right mouse button click instantly. Like this, it has a little startup. But if you dash, let me do it correctly. So I dash forward and I instantly stab, which is a great addition to it. I mainly use it like this. What you can also use is the backward pop and do it like that, but in all fairness it seems to do less damage and it's not as useful as the other way. So I kinda like this skill because I think it it just looks awesome. Just the awesome Kawarimi no Jitsus. And I think that kind of rounds up all of the strats on this character. Hope you guys liked it as much as I do. So stay tuned for more. I will be doing an in-depth guide on how to skill this class. That will be the next video. But so far, this was Tabby. Peace.